come out both in turn, Sir William Dudley. And you would get here welcome to Sir Christopher Hatton. singular privilege, inasmuch as we have been joined this day by no less august a presence than our own sweet and gentle sovereign. Wherein, I would you now to join me in offering here loyal and loving welcome for the majesty, the Queen, God save the Queen. God save the Having enjoyed your privilege of the introduction of these your courtiers, I would then continue now a tradition that was established by yourself near a decade past, wherein those worthy youngsters of the realm, born of a desire to offer greater service in your majesty's cause in future, might then here present themselves and receive your recognition. That I shall have. Bring them forward. Good people. I ask you now to make your welcome our honorary lord and lady of the list, the sweet and gentle Lady Ava and bold Lord Blake, with these are attendant outriders, one font equestrian and escadrille. Do you now forward to the presence of the Queen and the acclaim of all those here assembled. For these stalwart youngsters, say you all, hip hip, hip hip, hip hip, hip hip, hip
generously granted. And having received then their new status and having been elevated to equities in your majesty's service, I shall then ask of these worthies that they effect now their departure to that place of privilege that will reserve for their use, that they might this day pretend as your esteemed and honored guests, and indeed, and exercising their new office to act as your representatives <coughs> upon this our field of honor. Now then, and it please your majesty, and we have here to have satisfied propriety and protocol, I were given to understand that there were here ladies amongst your court who would have a mind to bestow then some tokens of esteem and devotion upon these most worthy fellows. The Lord Knights, would you now here advance to the board and receive then those goodly favors of these most delicate hands. Anybody down there before I have to walk that whole way? I'm actually rather lazy. <laughs> Yes. Mm. Original karaoke is spicy. And each of these fellows then having here favors in turn, I would you now return to your place and with your majesty's this grace is consent, true. we shall then give commence. But I think we shall then leave it to the discernment of our knights as to which part of the field they shall then appeal for aid and support during the course of their efforts. With this then to meet with your pleasure, I would then send forth that we might to witness his choice, good Sir Marcus Desmond. Your Majesty, 
I would hear to ask of these men that they be now about their preparations for their first course of engagement, that which was known as the Basque on horse or sword to sword upon horseback, wherein they shall then here prepared to take them sword to half. I will, however, that they make first some two passes in salute, but first in honor of the presence of our most good and gracious sovereign, God save the Queen. God save the Queen. Their second salute shall to honor this our day of revelry. Hip hip. Yeah. From there, they shall to cast their banners to the side, take them their swords to hand, and engage in earnest, though there were here but one man remaining. Now for your part, good people, would this then to meet with your approval? Aye. Aye. And are you now prepared to cheer the efforts of your champion? Aye. Good well enough. The field would here set and at the ready. I see you thereby, good sirs, and now ready to now to ride on. For the first salute, God save the Queen. God save the Queen. Can you hear about for the second salute? And for rebel, if it? Now to cast your banners to the side, take you then here your swords to hand, and now ready, do you now to lay off. Do it there and with a will. Come to get better account yourselves. Children, to the two thousand of the past hand. Forward to the banners, some of my most primitive people out of the press. Forward boldly there, sir. Some polite play. You got him on the defensive yet again. Push forward there. Woo, go get him. Yeah. Woo. He went that away. You then hear the half to your results from him. take lance in hand and prepare to face each other in a manly joust? Aye! Good gentles, would you see this? Aye! Would you see this? Aye! Would you see this? Aye! Aye. 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 We shall then, if they be here about their final preparation, before they shall to take up lance to the first of the passes drawn saying. These then passes in the French manner, wherein they shall pass from left shoulder to left shoulder, lance couch cross their horse's neck, and as they meet in the center, they shall there to strike as hard and well they may, in an effort to break lance, thereby scoring point, 
or to take the necessary strength and skill to overtop their helpless opponent, thereby securing their victory outright. Now, Your Majesty, I propose we make of this contest a round-robin competition, wherein these fellows shall pace each other in alternating pairs, and those who did in achieve the greater score or the unhorsing shall advance then to the final. I like this well, proceed as such. Having then your goodly permission, so then shall it be. And I think they, as they are here prepared and ready, we shall call them to the fore, Sir Marcus Desmond and Sir Andrew Wilcox. Good people. Are you prepared to support the efforts of your champion? Aye, aye. I think this were best accomplished, should you then to take his name as your champ. Thereby, as they make now their preparations, say you for your man, Andrew, Andrew, Andrew. Marcus, 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 Marcus. Marcus! Marcus! Now then, the knights are here prepared, the field were near in readiness, and when it were prepared, we shall then hear to our first pass this day. Are you with them? Aye! Aye! Start you then your goodly chant. Marcus! 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 Knights, it's already now charge on it. Marcus! Marcus! some two points and the advantage. Would you that they have yet another chance to prove their worth? Aye. Start you your chant and set them forth in fire. Marcus. 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 Sir Christopher Hatton. Good lords and ladies, are you with them? Aye. Start you then your chant, William Christopher. Sir Christopher. And for Sir William, having scored in turn a goodly hit and a lawfully shivered lance, he holds then some two points and the advantage. Shall we allow them yet another chance to show their skill? This should then to determine our victor thereby. Well enough, take you then your places. Start you now your chant that we might set them forth. 
sons of Pharaohs. <laughs> right. Now I do not recall that the Rod St. Pierre is regarded brawling like brigands and ruffians in the film. And I would you now for your parts to I'll put your hands down your great gordon was get somebody shot my wall. <laughs> Uh, Your Majesty, I would hear Sorome. I was right, greatly impressed by that skill, by that good-natured spirit that was seen in this competition throughout, and that they would then hear solely what has gone before would not be credited. This would hear your opportunity to make good impression and gain the favor of the Queen, and you choose rather to squander it with these gross displays of kissing <laughs> Your Majesty, being but rude and rustic head knights, I think having allowed your opportunity for their ardor to cool and their hot blood to mayhap even itself, we should, by your generous suggestion, grant them one final chance to here redeem themselves. Would you then agree? Aye. Aye. I shall then to ask that they do now to arm as they choose, and they shall to face each other one final time in honorable combat up the aid, man to man upon the ground. Would you have it so? Aye! Aye. You're well enough. I ask that you then go, sir, to offer now a salutation. God save the Queen! God save the Queen! Salute these, your noble supporters. Yeah! yeah. 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 For your champion, William Marcus! 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 Thank you. 